save him, the Almighty, the wise. Lo, religion with Allah is the surrender to his will and guidance. Those who formerly received the scripture differed only after knowledge came unto them through transgression among themselves. Whoso disbelieveth the revelations of Allah will find that lo, Allah is swift at reckoning. And if they argue with thee, O Muhammad, say, I have surrendered my purpose to Allah, and so have those who follow me. And say unto those who have received the scripture, and those who read not, Have ye too surrendered? If they surrender, then truly are they rightly guided. And if they turn away, then it is thy duty only to convey the message unto them. Allah is seer of his bondmen. Lo, those who disbelieve the revelations of Allah and slay the prophets wrongfully and slay those of mankind who enjoin equity, promise them a painful doom. Those are they whose works have failed in the world and the hereafter, and they have no helpers. Hast thou not seen how those who have received the scripture invoke the scripture of Allah in their disputes, that it may judge between them? Then a faction of them turn away, being opposed to it. That is because they say, the fire will not touch us, save for a certain number of days. That which they used to invent hath deceived them regarding their religion. How will it be with them when we have brought them all together to a day of which there is no doubt, when every soul will be paid in full what it hath earned, and they will not be wronged? Say, O Allah, owner of sovereignty, thou givest sovereignty unto whom thou wilt, and thou withdrawest sovereignty from whom thou wilt. Thou exaltest whom thou wilt, and thou abasest whom thou wilt. In thy hand is the good. Lo, thou art able to do all things. Thou causest the night to pass into the day, and thou causest the day to pass into the night. And thou bringest forth the living from the dead, and thou bringest forth the dead from the living. And thou givest sustenance to whom thou choosest without stint. Let not the believers take disbelievers for their friends in preference to believers. Whoso doth that hath no connection with Allah unless it be that ye but guard yourselves against them, taking, as it were, security. Allah biddeth you beware only of himself. Unto Allah is the journey. Say, O Muhammad, whether ye hide that which is in your breasts or reveal it, Allah knoweth it. He knoweth that which is in the heavens and that which is in the earth, and Allah is able to do all things. On the day when every soul will find itself confronted with all that it hath done of good and all that it hath done of evil, every soul will long that there might be a mighty space of distance between it and that evil. Allah biddeth you beware of him, and Allah is full of pity for his bondmen. Say, O Muhammad, to mankind, if ye love Allah, follow me. Allah will love you and forgive you your sins. Allah is forgiving, merciful. Say, obey Allah and the messenger. But if they turn away, 
Lo, Allah loveth not the disbelievers in his guidance. Lo, Allah preferred Adam and Noah and the family of Abraham and the family of Imran above all his creatures. They were descendants one of another. Allah is hearer, Noah. Remember when the wife of Imran said, My Lord, I have vowed unto thee that which is in my belly as a consecrated offering. Accept it from me. Lo, thou, only thou, art the hearer, the knower. And when she was delivered, she said, My Lord, lo, I am delivered of a female. Allah knew best of what she was delivered. The male is not as the female, and lo, I have named her Mary. And lo, I crave thy protection for her and for her offspring from Satan the outcast. And her Lord accepted her with full acceptance and vouchsafed to her a goodly growth and made Zachariah her guardian. Whenever Zachariah went into the sanctuary where she was, he found that she had food. He said, O Mary, whence cometh unto thee this food? She answered, It is from Allah. Allah giveth without stint to whom he will. Then Zachariah prayed unto his Lord and said, My Lord, bestow upon me of thy bounty goodly offspring. Lo, thou art the hearer of prayer. And the angels called to him as he stood praying in the sanctuary, Allah giveth thee glad tidings of a son whose name is John, who cometh to confirm a word from Allah. Lordly, chaste, a prophet of the righteous. He said, My Lord, how can I have a son when age hath overtaken me already and my wife is barren? The angel answered, So it will be. Allah doth what he will. He said, My Lord, appoint a token for me. The angel said, the token unto thee shall be that thou shalt not speak unto mankind three days except by signs. Remember thy